Don't panic when you encounter a blue screen error. I'm going to show you how to fix this problem step by step. Let's begin. Now we need to click on advanced options, then click on troubleshoot. Now click on advanced options and at the last we need to click on command prompt. Now type chkdsk space slash f space slash r space c colon and hit enter. Now we need to wait for some time to complete the process. Type c colon and hit enter to execute the command. Now type cd space c colon slash and hit enter to execute the command. Type cd space windows and simply hit enter to execute the command. Now type cd system32 and hit enter. Now type cd space config and hit enter. Then type md space backup and hit enter. Now type copy space star dot star space backup and simply hit enter to execute the command. Now type md space backup1 and simply hit enter. Once we are here, we need to execute this command. Type copy space star dot star space backup1 and then press enter from your keyboard to execute this command. Now type cd reg back and hit enter. Now type dir and then simply hit enter to execute the command. Now type copy space star dot star space dot dot and hit enter. Then type all and hit enter. Now type bootrec space slash fix mbr and simply hit enter. Now type bootrec space slash fix boot and hit enter to execute now type cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter now type cd space windows slash system32 slash config slash rage back and hit enter to execute now type this command bcd edit space slash export space c colon slash bcd backup and hit enter now execute this command type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type this md space boot and hit enter now type cd space boot and simply hit enter now execute this command type md space bcd now type cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter now type attrib space c colon dash boot dash bcd space dash h space dash r space dash s and hit enter to execute now type run space c colon backslash boot backslash bcd space bcd dot old then hit enter now type bootrec space slash rebuild bcd and simply hit enter now type exit and simply hit enter now click on continue it will restart your system so that's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go